hyper local is the new buzzword but supply chain management seems to be a challenge let's find out from varun khurana the cto of grofers how they are managing this riddle thanks varun uh, for joining us how are you solving this riddle rather it's a tough problem right you know we are dealing with um, we are dealing i would say at a grassroots level we are dealing with you know all kinds of merchants merchants who are you know who are i would say not organized at all you know who manage their inventory on uh, you know like on so they order some stuff you know in the morning at the end of the day they just see ki you know okay this all stuff is emptying out hey why don't you place an order so that is the way they function right and we are kind of you know relying on them to um, you know basically for do fulfillment for our customers so it is a challenge right tech enabling a lot of these guys is not going to be easy so that is one that is one problem that we are working on um the other piece of uh, you know the puzzle also is that even if we do that so one of the things that is happening is that once you know they partner with grofers we are actually able to empty their shelves up very quickly so what that means is that you know we'll have to help them more on the supply side as well right do you think it's unique to india or globally uh, hyper local companies are facing this challenge so i would say um yes and no so um, you know there are countries like if i talk about the us right so us would not face this problem because you know like i would say smaller merchants and you know mom and pop stores and things like that is not what you know are there in the us us is known for their chains right like the walmarts the best buys and whatever right however having said that there are places which are facing this challenge you know which are i would say where the problem is kind of similar so you know china is sort of similar so it's not too far off so yes and no right and what are the unique steps that you guys have taken uh, as a company to solve this you know it's it's the way i look at it it's like technology for the masses you know it's things that they can use and it's very simple and uh you know keeping in mind that you know you know our infrastructure is not the best but you know still kind of developing you know i i mean such you know simple systems for some of these merchants so that they're able to use it like very very seamlessly you know and we are talking you know bad connectivity right we are talking about different languages so so yeah so yeah so that is how we are you know we are trying to kind of uh, solve some of these riddles right uh, you spoke about infrastructure so uh, how do you think the government can help in any way or uh, give an impetus that's a tough one that's a tough i mean i mean you know the government can do a lot of things but i mean there are challenges inside the government right you know, a lot of the initiatives and things that are that are i would say decided at the higher levels you know don't make their way all the way to the ground right you know that those are some of the challenges that i think if we are um you know even if that happens you know i think that really helps um but you know education helps right i mean if a lot of these guys are educated they'll know a lot more they will be able to run their businesses more efficiently so you're really saying that a lot of things at a socio economic level will uh, help solve this oh yes i mean because we are we are dealing with people at the grassroots level right and right. i think that is where a lot of these you know reforms and all of that they don't always make their way to so um so i think yes all right Thank you for joining us and wish you good luck. Thanks. Thanks. You have raised multiple rounds of funding. Are you going to use some of this for inorganic growth for acquisitions? There's nothing on the cards right now. Uh, we keep getting a lot of queries, but uh, we are open to it. If there's something which really adds value to the team or the business as such, we'd be sort of happy to do that. 10 future mobile technologies, 10 promising mobile sparks companies, but this one in particular will just blow your mind. Let's look at my child app